It's me, I'm Zubir from Cluster. Welcoming all of you to Islamic greetings. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Today, I am here to deliver a topic on endoplasmic reticulum. As you know, cell is the structure and functional unit of life. But, do you know where the protein synthesis occur? Where the lipids are produced? And there is a network of membranous tubes known as endoplasmic reticulum where this all happens. So let Come with me to explore the endoplasmic reticulum. It was discovered by Kate Porter and other part in mid-20th century. It are consisted of small tubular structures that are dispersed in the cytoplasm. It is a network of membranous tubes that extend from the nuclear membrane to plasma membrane. As you can see here, it extends from the nuclear membrane towards the plasma membrane. Towards the plasma membrane as it extends from the outer membrane of the nucleus. Now I will tell you about its functions. It gives internal support to the cell, enables the synthesis of proteins and lipids. It detoxifies any drugs or toxins. Now I will tell you about these types. There are two types of endoplasmic reticulum, smooth endoplasmic reticulum and rough endoplasmic reticulum. First I will tell you about the rough endoplasmic reticulum. These are the rough on outside. Then the dietal layer, the ribosomes. These are the these are that type, this is that type of endoplasmic reticulum that carries out the protein synthesis. Now I will tell you about the smooth endoplasmic reticulum. It's a smooth on outside and has nothing to do with ribosomes. It helps in producing the lipids, also known as light molecules. Thank you very much.